guys, we have a snack box to do for you today. So this one is called Low Cows with a K. With a K. And this one and a is Z. and a Z. I know, Oof. super, super cute. Um, this one is, as the name suggests, a lower calorie snack box, and this one comes with drinks as well. What is Low Cows? Low Cows is a monthly subscription box that is full of yummy low calorie drinks and snacks. Each month, we will surprise you. With something new to try, examples include 100 calorie snacks, five calorie drinks, and many more cool surprises. And then you get 5% off of your next uh, box by posting a picture of your box on Twitter or Instagram and tagging them. Oh, okay, nice. cool. It's got, the, it's got the prices right on there. So you're going to have Perfect. to look them up. Okay, cool. Okay. So let's see what we got. I'm always a little hesitant about locale snacks. I know, right? This so... one is the um, 15 item box. Hey, we've had, we we've definitely had these. Garden Veggie Straws, the Zest. Ranch. Oh, those are the good ones too. These like are actually flavor. really tasty. And these are <laughs> love those, right, June? 130 calories per serving. And one serving is the entire bag. So this is actually a good a good amount of food. Because to me it's like how many how much food do I get per calories, right? Because we're a nation right. of we're a nation of cheap calories. We're very good at coughing out large amounts of calories for a small amount of money. But what you really want is you want to be full with eating a small amount of calories. Right. So yeah, these are these are actually really tasty. You don't want to try these, or we've already tried these, or do we just try everything? Uh, well, let's because we know we like those, so let's save those. Yeah, these are delicious, so we're gonna put these off to the side. Okay. Um, these I don't think we've had the Smart Food Delight Sea Salted Caramel, and then just Sea Salt. If you like your sea without caramel or with caramel, I think a caramel salty or sweet snack yeah, right there. I think I'd like a caramel flavored ocean. I think that would be delicious. So let's <laughs> let's give these a try. Okay. Yeah, I haven't had this brand before. I've had lots of other popcorns. Can I just yeah. and try and these are uh, these are seventy calories for each. each popcorn's bag. a nice low cal mm -hmm. snack. I like that Not they're the individually. I, <laughs> I was just gonna say I like the way they're individually packaged too. So this is one serving. You don't get a giant bag, Mommy. but then you're like, what? I ate the whole bag. So what? Yeah, yeah. Mommy, so, uh, hmm, those are actually fairly really plain. Probably. They could use salt. Um, oddly enough. Not bad. It's not movie theater popcorn, but they're tasty. Yeah. For a I mean, low calorie snack. For a low calorie snack, they're actually not bad because yeah. I'm I'm on the like, oh my god, don't give me a low calorie snack even though I'm probably need it. But <laughs> these are good. I would totally eat these. I'm actually really happy about those. Alright, boom chicka pop Angie's, boom chicka pop cocoa kettle corn. All right, at another 150 popcorn. calories for so double the calories of the other popcorn. There's another popcorn in here. Oh my god, popcorn. I didn't even see that. It's all popcorn. <laughs> if you like popcorn. Okay, so we have three from this Smart Food Delight brand. I mean, what flavor is that one? Oh, uh, uh -huh. white cheddar. Mm, that's usually my jam. How is it? Mm, my favorite. Yeah, white cheddar is always my favorite. Mm. I'm gonna eat like that it? all day. Yummy. Yeah, it is yummy, huh? All right, so let's try it because this is how many um, ounces are those? Okay, this um, the whole bag. Yeah, the whole bag. So is it right? Half here? an ounce. Half an ounce. Oh, okay, it's not bad. This is actually one. It's double the calories, but it's a full ounce. Actually, how many calories is that? Seventy. Yeah, seventy. Yeah, so there's 150, but it's a full ounce, so it's twice as much. That's actually pretty good. I've never had cocoa kettle corn before. Let's see, and neither have I. Okay, too. That's actually really tasty. It's a bit, the, ke the cocoa is a bit powdery, mm -hmm. um, but yeah, those are tasty. Oh. You like them, June? Yeah, that's not bad. Yeah. Like, you know, when you're craving chocolate? Yeah. Yeah, that's really not bad at all. All right, let's keep that's digging through good. here. Oh, potato chips. I'm sorry. Real vegetable chips. Potato is a vegetable, people. Oh, I love those. It's parsnip, taro, sweet potato, yucca, and batata. No potatoes. <laughs> what is that? That's the, you know, Americans are great at eating their vegetables, but unfortunately it's in the form of potato, or I'm sorry, it's in the form of french fries. Mm. So it's, you know. Okay, so dried chips. Lots of different types of dried chips. Yeah. Hmm. Tasty. I don't know which one that was, but oh. It actually shows you on the back, so you can match up the color to what you're eating, just in case you're like... Is it really? Oh, that's mm -hmm. cute. Yeah, I like that a lot. Mm -hmm. Those are unique. Yeah, that's kind of cool, where you can you can pull out a chip, and then, oh my god, the annoying person at the party going, what is this? Okay, let me... I would totally be Match it up. <laughs> uh, mm, 
Snyder's of Hanover, anything Snyder's of Hanover really is gonna be good. Pretzels are usually pretty low calorie, 160 calories for the whole thing. Uh, sourdough nibblers. Ooh, they have some like honey mustard ones that are my favorite. You, lost, you had me at honey, you lost me at, why is it always honey followed by mustard? Just stop at honey. <laughs> Just stop with the honey. The honey is the perfect part. You need to ruin it with mustard. I would just the honey and more honey. Double the honey. Double the honey. Yeah. Awesome. What? Pretzel? Oh, pretzel. Mm -hmm. These are very dry. See? The honey mustard are better. Little dry honey. <laughs> what? Does she not like them? No. Just too dry? Need some water. Yeah, you definitely need some water to go with these. Um, they are good. They're a bit on the drier side. I actually like the little pretzel sticks. I can eat it. <laughs> I do like them, but they're, um, yeah, they're definitely They're dry. really dry. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Oh, we've got some, uh, actually, we have these. We've had these a hundred times. Andy's oh, yeah. homegrown bunny fruit snacks. I'm sure you recognize those, June. You know what these are, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Which, um, to me, like, I'm a, I'm a fan of, like, the old school, you know, regular gummy bears. So, I mean, these are a bit squishier. Then they got me, they're not really chewy. Mm. They're just kind of like, they're almost like a little, those little um, fruit strips, just like chunks cut out of the fruit strips. So they're, they're fine, it's 70 calories. If you want something that's akin to a gummy bear. My kids love them. these, they yeah. would eat these all day long. Wow, in a full white label package of Kellogg's Nutri-Green. Oh wow. Nutri-Green bar. Okay, so we've got a cereal bar. A couple cereal bars, well two, two cereal bars. A little blueberry, a strawberry. Kashi, Chocolate almond sea salt with chia. That is too many words for a package that small. Uh, and then Nature Valley sweet and salty nut peanut butter. So fairly standard bars. Um, and uh, these are all good. I mean, this is one of the, you know, standard, I think, low calorie snacks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we've had these before. These are yeah, I think we, like breakfast bars. Yeah, I think we've had all of these. And they're, they're all great. Although I do like with the Nature Valley ones, I do microwave them for a couple seconds. And it goes from exploding when you open them to it, it softens them up a lot. Just a little pro tip for you now. I'm gonna try this one because I've never tried this one before. Okay, go Kashi one. Oh no, I haven't either. Let's try. My um, Whoa. my stepdad likes to eat Kashi cereal. Mm. Well, I don't know if he likes it, but he eats it. <laughs> that should be their that should be their jingle. That should be like their marketing <laughs> campaign. We know you don't like it, but we know why you're eating it. <laughs> It's chocolatey, right? Mm -hmm. What do you think? Do you like it? Mm -hmm. Not bad. It's, it's not bad. Chewy, granola, mm -hmm. chocolate. I don't know what's up with the chias, but. Chewy texture. Not bad. I'd eat it. Yeah. Not like every day, but I'd eat it. Not every day. <laughs> Alright, so we've got some drinks in here. Yeah, that's um, some drinks we got. The Vita Coco. We, we have gallons of this stuff. Oh yeah, we drink that all the time. Um, I bring this whenever I go out to the racetrack. This is this will hydrate you better than, certainly better than Gatorade, um, or especially like sodas or anything like that. Uh, and and uh, this yeah, brand are, isn't too syrupy and sweet, because some of them are. Yeah, although my favorite, honestly, um, when I go to the store, I find, I try and find like the quote unquote all natural ones that have the chunks of, um, Oh, the big coconut chunks? Yeah, in? the big coconut chunks, because my friend Brian got it for me once, and now I've just been stuck getting the ones with chunks in it because they're delicious, and you get a little uh, coconut snack. So that's always a plus. Okay, that is June gonna be likes this one. <laughs> yeah, June's all over the chocolate one. All right, so we can try these other two. These are, we've had these in the fridge for a little bit. Kiwi, strawberry, sparkling ice, zero calorie something. I have no idea. I'm Let's hoping that that one doesn't taste too artificially sweetened, sweetened. You know yeah, I mean? some of these things, I had that, I had like the Vita Coco or one of its competitors, oh, it's fizzy. Um, it was like the watermelon version of it. That was nasty. Oh, was yeah, the flavored acceptable. ones aren't my favorite. No, they're bad. Mm -hmm. I like the, this plain ones. I want to buy those. That's exactly how it looks like it tastes. It's not bad. You know what it tastes like? It tastes like watered down Mountain Dew. No, Mountain Dew is so much better than this. Like I said, watered down Mountain Dew. No, because it's really sweet. It's like it did not need to be that sweet. It's exceedingly sweet. Mama, I'm not going to fight over it. Okay, you don't have to try it. Um, I actually don't mind that one. It's not terrible. It's just it's just too sweet. Although, you know, I don't like super sweet drinks. Yeah, no, I do. 
So to me, to me, I actually liked this one. I think it's, I think it's totally fine uh, oh for goodness. a zero calorie drink. Uh, you know, it tastes better than Diet Mountain Dew. I'll put it that mm. way. Uh, it th I didn't think that it tasted too artificial. You know, when you have that like sucralose, yucky aftertaste. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah I didn't, see, I didn't get that in this. Yeah. I didn't so yeah, I would I would totally get this before I bought. Weird I would totally dinner. get this before I got a diet Mountain Dew. So. Oh, that's good. Okay, okay. so right, June, this, I think wants uh, to try this one. So we've got aloe vera plus yeah. watermelon plus peach. Aloe you really vera like the aloe drink. drinks. I do like the aloe drinks. Um, yeah, they're actually really tasty. So let's give this one a shot. This one doesn't have the chunks or anything. No. How is it? Has tiny little chunks in it. Great, my favorite. You can actually taste the peach in there, which is usually overpowered by other things, but it's uh, it's not bad. Yeah, I don't mind it at all. I don't like the chunks, um, but the See, flavor that's the is problem. nice. See, I, is I totally like like you know the. I don't boba. even like pulp in my orange juice. I'm like. Yeah. See, I like the pulp and the boba and the the chunks in the in, in all the drinks. Yeah. So. It just makes me feel like somebody backwashed in my drink. That is disgusting and not how bad that it is. That is why I don't um, like it. So, right. um, <laughs> but the flavor is really good. It is. I don't know why they call it comfort, but anyway. You know, it's funny. I haven't really seen aloe vera juice drinks in the market. They seem to have been washed out by coconut drinks. Remember when it was all pomegranate for a while? Mm. Everything was palm wonderful and that was going to be the biggest, and then it died and like, you know, the next cycle coconut took off. Coconut water so, has been very big. It's funny. Yeah, I haven't actually seen, I haven't seen this stuff in, in a little while, but this is, oh, 25% juice. Water, aloe vera juice, vera pulp, cane, oh, cane sugar. Yeah, let me take it out of the wrapper. This package. is 70 calories, though. So, um, yeah, this is good. This is still 17 grams of sugar. It is pretty sweet, and this guy is probably, yeah, zero. So, yeah. I mean, I don't know. It depends on it depends on what you're looking for, but, um, yeah, I, I liked them. I thought they were fine. But there's probably, is there artificial sweetener in here? No, it's, uh, I think, what they say, cane sugar? June stuff, flopping around. Yeah, so if you don't like artificial sweeteners, you know, and it's not that bad. I mean, it's not that much sugar. It's not that, oh, it's not that drink. bad sugar. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah. Not, I, I just mean the sugar content. All right. Um, okay, well, I think that this is a really awesome box. You know, we yes. used to get a lot of other snack boxes, and we were like, it's just too much junk food, you know? We're trying to eat healthier. And so when the company contacted me, I was really excited and I'm still excited. I think that this is a great snack box. Yeah, like, I actually do like it a lot. These are good snacks to have around. I, I started working from home most of the time. And so that's one of the challenges is, you know, you've got your entire refrigerator full of stuff to go after. And right. so I found I need, I need things to be laid out, you know, like you were, you were laying out snap peas or something like that. Mm -hmm. Cause I'll just eat whatever the heck is laying around. So, right. um, yeah, having things like this laying around instead of sugary drinks or anything else is perfect. Uh, yeah. And you've got a sweet craving are... or a salty craving. Mm -hmm. So, okay. Awesome. Right. Well, I will leave all of the information in the description box. I believe I have a 20% off discount code. So if you do want to sign up, make sure you look for that in the description box. All right, well, thank you guys so much for watching, and thank you, Locals, for sending us this box. It was fun. Do you like it, June? Yeah, good stuff? Yeah, totally. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you in our next video. Bye! Bye.